welcome to my channel. I am Rachel from Her Thrive and I am super excited that you're here. I am planning in my Erin Condren catch-all planner and I am using the new Happy Planner planning guides. It comes with one, two, three, four, five different um, layouts and I'm using the custom one because it doesn't have anything on it. So that's perfect for the Erin Condren. It doesn't line up exactly but that's okay. I guess it'll kind of work the same way does that the wax paper does. So I have not used these before. I tried, now I did try them out, but I didn't, haven't actually planned with them. And so this is my very first time. I don't know if it's smart to do that with an Erin Condren since it doesn't line up well, but I feel like I could just move it around the way you would wax paper. Okay, so I picked this up, um, Chrissy Ann Designs sticker book from Michaels. And it has like weekly kits, I guess, but they're, oh my goodness. They're like rainbow or every color of the rainbow and some, yeah, different colors back here. And so I thought it'd be good to use this for St. Patrick's Day. I would do, I want to do a rainbow layout, like red, orange, yellow, you know, like a rainbow instead of, um, I thought about doing that or just using the green ones. When I purchased this, I thought I'll just use the green and pink because I love green and pink for St. Patrick's Day, but I've never done a rainbow layout. So I'm going to try that. And instead of using red, I'm going to use these pink ones here. Okay. So I, again, have never used these before. I've never used these um, planner guides and I'm kind of, I don't really know how to use them. Honestly, like do people... Like I've seen people with that wax paper, they just move things around. I don't think they laid their whole thing out. Maybe they did, I don't know. I'll have to go back and look at some YouTube videos, but I'm gonna try to see if this works now. I don't even know why I'm putting all of this stuff down, you guys, because all my plans this week, or most of them, are canceled because of the wonderful coronavirus or COVID-19 that you should know about, unless you're living under a rock. Um. Yeah, the entire world, even if you're not in the United States. So, anyways, a lot of my things is canceled. Like, a lot of the functional things are canceled. So, I should really just use a bunch of decorative things. But, um, instead, I'm going to be tracking what I'm going to be doing this week, if that makes sense. Um, well, duh. You're tracking what you're doing. But, I meant, like, my home things. And, I'm just putting these down because I feel like I want to know what color to use. I need like a guide to help me know what color to use. Okay. We use green over here. And we'll use this one. Roy G. Biv. Okay. So I guess I'm going with a V type thing. I guess that's what I'm doing. green Roy G B I V. okay so I don't think oh yeah there is a blue but there's not an indigo there is a purple like two different shades of purple I noticed that that was kind of weird okay and these are vinyl stickers if you're not familiar with Christian designs they're vinyl so they're very removable I probably honestly didn't even need to use these planner guides but I've never used them on an Erin Condren but I imagine that they work the same I know the paper is a little bit different than a happy planner but I'm pretty sure it'd be the same I just didn't want to risk it in case they didn't, but I'll try it in a minute. In a minute, I will try. And I didn't, I could have used the same exact sticker, you know, with the stitching or this square one, but I kind of wanted to do, I kind of like the variety of it. Okay, so there we go. So now we know what rainbow's on there. And I honestly, I don't know what to do. I don't know if I should just keep planning this whole out and then transfer it or just go ahead and transfer these as I go. I think that's what I'm going to do because I don't, I don't like the idea of having to take off every single sticker um, afterwards and then replacing them down. I feel like that would get kind of hard. Okay, cool. let's just go, let's go with that. Should have paid attention to the lines where I put these, you know. So this really just needs to be lined up with that. Put that here. Oh my goodness, my daughter! I think they're watching the new Frozen Two that was released early, so that 
Everyone that is self-quarantining at home has something to watch. And she is laughing her pants off up there. So if you hear her screaming her pants off, it's she's laughing. <laughs> Which is a wonderful sound if you are a mother. Unless you're like trying to film, but I don't think anyone on here is going to care too much. Okay. I don't know if these planner guides are going to work, work out. You guys, honestly, I don't know if I'm going to continue using them throughout this planner uh, layout. I don't know that I need them. Especially that these are vinyl. Let me try removing these. I mean, they work pretty well. How about I just put these aside in case I want to try something out? I don't know that I like the idea of sticking everything down and then pulling it all up and sticking it there. Does that make sense? Like maybe I'll just do the way they do with wax paper and just kind of see if that's where I want something and then place it. I think that's what I'm going to do. Because, yeah, I don't like that. I, I feel like it's taken me more time to do that. Okay, so I'm going to go back to this pink sheet over here. And then that glare won't be there as well, right? Yeah, the glare is gone. Okay, making sure I'm in the frame. Um, I am going, I saw this blue. Well, this is purple. To me, it's purple. Ah, wrong one. And that's kind of the tricky thing. It's like I'm going to have to do one day at a time. And I normally don't plan like that. I normally just grab things and put it where it goes. I don't need to use the A day, B day because we have an extended um, spring break. So I normally put A day or B day up here for my son's school schedule since I take him to a different campus on certain days. But I don't need to do that. So I won't be doing that. I'm going to put this here. This is my work schedule, which is normal. And I don't know if I should go in and just... No, I'm going to put what I need down per square. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this one down here. So I don't even know if I'm going to use that, honestly, because I'm, I'm over here just placing things, but we'll see. I may not even use, like, that may not even show up very well. Since I am putting stickers everywhere. If I, I guess if I did decor, that would work. But... Um, since, well, it's a day off for everyone, every single day, um, this week. I don't know if I'm going to put those. I might remove that because I don't know if I want to put that every day there. Anyways, this is not, okay, this is, we were supposed to be off on Monday anyways, right? And then they extended spring break through the rest of the week. So I feel like I'm going to let the kids do whatever they want on Monday, like it's spring break. But then on Tuesday, we're going to get to work because they were supposed to be off on Monday. So I'm not going to add an extra day to them. So that's what I'm going to do for that. I'm going to put this little TV sticker here because, I don't know, I just feel like I'll mark what we watched that day. And then there's no, my meal plans normally go down here, and I don't see anything to mark um, meals. Actually, I forget about the back. There's things in the back. Let's see if there's anything for meals. There is. Okay, so I'm going to use this sticker here. Oh, I'm so glad that there's more because I was, I was worried about using all of my little um, computers. I'm wondering if these are smaller. If these are smaller, I'd rather use. Uh, they are slightly smaller, but not enough to make a difference for me to go and remove those. I don't know why I took that off because I wanted a meal plan one. <laughs> that is not a meal. Okay, right here. So I guess this little layout is going to be super... Um, uniformed? Maybe not. We'll see if I continue doing... I, I probably won't use the same exact stickers for all of them. But since these are... Nope, I'm going to go back to the orange. Okay. We put don't forget because I know that we are still meeting with our small group and I need to... I want the one that says don't forget... I am snack duty, and honestly, I'm, I usually cook something, but I'm going to buy something because, I don't know, I'm being weird. I feel like we shouldn't cook for each other because we should be careful about germs. Maybe that's silly. I don't know. So, yeah, let's put these down here, and then I don't know if I want to put a day off there. Probably not. I'm probably going to remove that. I'm going to leave that there because that's technically our spring break. And this is going to be like our homeschool type day. 
Um, so I'm going to actually leave that there. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this there. Just cover that up for my work hours. And then um, I would use like rescheduled or canceled if I had already written something. I could put that because my dance was canceled. I don't know if our youth group's going to be canceled or not. I just don't know. I'm going to put this here. And then if it does, well, then I will put the cancel sticker over there because um, church was not canceled today. So I'm, I don't know. Okay. And then we're going to move on to the green one. I'm going to use this little, my little computer. Where did you go? And I'm going to use, oh, the yellow one because we always watch This Is Us on Wednesdays because we have group on Tuesdays. And so we'll put this one here. Nope, that's the house, not the TV. So I'm going to put this one here, kind of offset it a little bit. Yeah. This might be a boring layout. <laughs> we'll see. Green, I'm going to put um, the Skid It Done sticker down here for all the things we're going to do at home. I plan on like organizing some things, like getting my daughter to do some work so she's just not on screens all day and she's getting some actual like learning in and then I plan on um, doing a like for myself I mean I work from home from home as it is so it's not really a big deal for me um, it's actually I feel like I'm gonna be less productive because my daughter's gonna be home all day so that kind of stinks that um, my productivity like I have to let her entertain herself for a little while so I can work but it's not like I feel like some people are gonna get more things done and I'm not because I don't normally have my kids like people who don't normally work from home will get their work, their work done and not have a commute and all that, that actually all that, all those little things add up and help, but I, that nothing's going to change for me. So it kind of just stinks that I'm going to be less productive. I'm going to have to keep my daughter entertained and just, you know, Oh, I, do I have like an important or don't forget or something? Cause I have my planner class and only one person signed up and I'm not going to continue to promote it because no one wants to make plans and sign up for things, um, right now because they don't know if it's going to get canceled. So I totally get that, but I'm not going to be promoting things and asking people to come or whatever because they may not be able to do that or yeah, they'll, because they're canceling classes after next week. And so I just know that no one wants to commit to anything for the fear that it's just going to get canceled anyways. That makes sense. I wish there was some more like, oh, well, there are back here. I guess I'll do that. So I do need to add that. I'm going to have to put gas tomorrow for sure. Or my car is not going to start. It's not going to last very long. And then... I'm going to use these for like things that we're organizing because it's a clean sticker. Um, I feel like that's a good idea. We're not doing any lunch dates, dinner dates, coffee dates. We're not doing none of that for sure. Okay. And then I wanted to use these orange sticker, not orange stickers, these pots for like my meal plan. I like to put those down here. So I'm going to go in and stick these here. This might not be the funnest layout I've ever done as far as like you watching me do it, but I think it's going to be fun when I'm done with it. Like it's going to look cute that it's all rainbowish, and I might get some happy planner stickers if the rainbow colors match. I might get some happy planner stickers, the rainbows, and stick those somewhere as well. Um, it's not a terrible idea. Let's go back and put the blue. because I forgot this one and then the purple one. And then I don't work on Sunday, so that one's gonna stay blank. But I need to put this one here and this one here. 
And I, I, I don't think I'm going to go off and put the day off. That's like the whole week. I feel like I could put it somewhere in, down here and say this week there is no school. I'll just put that here and put extended, like extended spring break right there. Um, I could put canceled like on everything. Like your, our whole week is just canceled with this whole coronavirus thing. It's kind of terrible, but I mean, I totally get it. We are trying to be safe, social distancing, distancing, all the things. I feel like by the end of this, everyone's going to remember the whole toilet paper crisis more than they will the actual virus. I feel like everyone was affected by that more than anything. We definitely, well, almost were. I had three rolls of toilet paper, three rolls left, and... Um, everyone around me was out, but my husband works in a different city and he was able to go into a store and it ended up being a bulk store. So he bought it in bulk because that's all they sell. So we are good for like two months and we're not, we were not trying to hoard. That was definitely not our intention, but it was just a bulk store. That's just how they do it. That's how everyone was buying at the store. So, um, they're like only one case. He's like, well, how much is in a case? Uh, that is enough. Okay, so yeah, I like this so far. I am not sure if I want to use some rainbows. Let me, hold on, let me see if I can go find them. Okay, so I found this sticker book and I think it actually will work perfect. I was afraid that the color of the rainbow may not, these colors may not match well, but it actually looks like it does because these aren't traditional rainbow colors and neither is some of these either, or I can make it work that way. Um, I know there's some actual rainbows. You see how the, oh, I don't know actually, but I thought there was some like rainbow stickers somewhere. Let's see if there's some actual rainbows in here. No, there is not. There has to be rainbow stickers in here. I know there's rainbow stickers in here somewhere. Yeah, there's the one that says today, fun times. Well, here's a rainbow sticker, but I just want like some rainbows. Okay, focus on you, fun times, happy plans. Um, I don't know if I want to put happy or yeah, happy times on there because that's not really the case. It's not really a happy time right now. I mean, it's not like a miserable time, but I'm just not sure I want to say that it's fun times, kind of serious times. I'm just going to leave those on there instead of putting throughout because I feel like I'm going to mess up my little rainbow vibe there. Yep. I already did that. Yep. Yeah. Yep. I'm going to leave that alone. So that is my layout. I hope you enjoyed watching this. It was a very easy layout. I just used mostly the Christian Designs um, sticker book, this one here, and a little bit of this one here. And I'm showing these to you because someone mentioned one time that I go way too fast when I show what I use. So I'm trying to be better about that. And then I used the sticker planning guides from the Happy Planner. These are sold at Michael's for sure. I don't know if they're at Joann's, but if they're for sure at Michael's and everything, of course, is on their website. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching this plan with me. And if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button so you can see more of these videos. And you should find me on Instagram at HerThrive. Thanks for watching. Bye.